listen to the rhythms of our slanted voices. Smart City Nairobi was really about working with developers in the city to help them think about how they can use Twitter and Twitter's API to build a solution to make Nairobi a smarter city. It was incredible. I think we didn't expect as many developers to come to the event and participate, which was, you know, it's phenomenal. The ideas that came through as well, they were really innovative. It was a really great experience overall. Basically, Reportaka's main aim is to ensure Nairobi is a smart and green city. So what it does is, if you're a normal pedestrian and you see some garbage piled at the corner of the street, just take a photo. You post it via Twitter, you can use your Twitter handle, or you can use, alternatively, our mobile app. You post the photo to our handle, Report Taka, and then us, we take the report and we forward it to the relevant authorities. So we have a backend where these authorities have all this data that we are sending to them so that they can take the relevant action. When you get to use our app, you'll be able to get real-time updates on traffic. You'll be, you'll be able to get uh, predictions. We want to tell you, like, when can you start your journey in the city? Just giving you optimum solution, the best possible. Fixinta is a web application that aggregates uh, reports about common societal problems from social media sites, email and SMS into one unified platform. On the citizen side, um, we try to make their life a little bit more easier and more manageable by giving them a reference number that they can be able to follow up uh, on the queries that they make and find out the status and actually try and find out, okay, is the issue that I raise, is it being actually resolved or not? What I thought maybe was unique about it is in a lot of places around the world where they had done these kind of Twitter smart cities challenges, there's a lot of sensors and this and that kind of work, but in this case, it was a lot more humans as sensors. Using people as the sensor to say, this is where this is, this is what's going on, here's a picture of it, whatever's needed. If we start marrying that up with some you know, cloud-based technology that takes that information and starts making it even more useful, we, we start having a real system where uh, the city does become smarter. The challenge, I feel, is extremely beneficial, particularly to the Nairobi community, um, because uh, the trend right now, or what a lot of uh, institutions are very interested right now, is solutions around connecting with government, around closing that feedback loop. And so for us, as the I have been able to engage the tech community in that conversation, around not just building tools, but building tools that are relevant to a city, uh, we felt was extremely important for us to be a part of. Just seeing people work together, the community, and given that some of us have never had the chance to come even to the IAM, so this is, this is something very exciting for us, and that we can build something. All in all, everyone's been of great deal help to us from the UX lab, I have research, and up there at, um, at the I have on top. And throughout that, um, we've met a lot of guys who've helped us to improve on our product. That road, please. So in the third place. We won. <laughs> I feel overwhelmed with joy. I thank God that we won. It's amazing. I think this is just the beginning of how we start to work with them, but also other developers to really start to think about how we can help support them. Um, by no means is this the end. We, we have a developer team in London that will be working with them in the future to help build this product. Um, and not just the product itself, when it comes to marketing and business decisions, there are people around Twitter that can also help support these teams. So just looking at the progress that they've made from one month ago when we were at Strathmore for the initial hackathon to the finals, we are extremely proud of them and extremely proud to have been a part of that process. <laughs>